Hey guys and girls of YouTube, my name is Kaz Wallace and in today's video I have something special for you. It's another build, it's called Premium Light and the actual developer who made Spins TV Wizard uh, developed this one and he wanted me to check it out. It's two different versions but you can download the regular version or the second version that has a little extra features with extra TV guides and stuff like that. Um, I tested out yesterday, I'm finally making a video today. Um, it's what I can say about it is pretty neat. It's pretty smooth. It has a nice little background continuously changing um, No, you know find the touches that make the whole experience of Kodi uh, Better it also has the updated stuff and it's very simple to install So if you find the other wizards are very hard to install this one is definitely easy If you look in the description below you're gonna see the source code or the source link uh, for spins TV wizard but I'm gonna show you how to install it, but you could just look at it right on a piece of paper or make it big so you can see it. But once you get that in your brain, uh, the next thing you wanna do, you wanna go to systems and then go down here to file manager and you wanna add source, all right? Uh, when you add source, uh, then you're gonna type in the same source link that's gonna be down low in the description. Uh, it's gonna be http colon forward slash forward slash repo dot spins tv dot com once you do that the next thing you want to do you just want to name it and you want to name it dot spins tv um that's, that's right there then you just want to press ok that's fine um if you will have an error message that means at that point that means you didn't enter it correctly or something like that or your internet is wrong uh or not connected so try to review and see if anything was entered incorrectly at this point next thing you want to do is go to systems and then go to settings and then you want to come down here to go to add-ons and then you want to install from zip uh, right here where it says spins tv uh, go down here where it says repository spins tv dot zip you want to install this this will uh, bring you to the repository for spins tv um, at this point if you have any errors saying deficiency or whatever make sure to install uh, super repo as you can see i don't have super repo installed on this but definitely uh, do that if you have any deficiency errors because what's happening is it needs files in the background so that's the repository is completed uh, next step after installing from zip uh, file will be to install from repository right here and then you want to go to spins tv dot uh, spins tv repository now once in spins tv repository it's a program file as it is a wizard uh, and you go into program add-ons and then go to spins tv wizard once again, if you have problems installing it, please install Super Repo. I'll leave it on the screen so you can see it. But if you are successful with installing it without Super Repo, then fine. Uh, then exit out. And then you want to go to Programs. And once in Programs, you're going to go to Program Add-ons if the screen doesn't pop up. And then this screen is going to pop up. And then you just want to go into Spins TV Wizard. And then you're going to be uh, showing a bunch of different wizards that Spins TV along with other persons who, who put their, their bills on Spins TV uh, that it has. So you can definitely check out all the different uh, bills that it has. But th in this video, I'm going to show you Premium Lite, the extra version. All right, It's two different versions, like I said. The first version is the regular Premium. Right? See, it says premium light updated to 28 of the night 2015 but then the second version said premium light with the multi tv guides 300 megabits uh premium light okay it's, it's saying the same thing over and over um so you, you can choose this one right here i see the thumbnail isn't popping up uh that but don't worry once you click it once you highlight it and you see the little things moving down here that means you have it and then you just want to click it choose either one both work but like i say in this video i'm going to be showing you the premium light with 300 uh, megabytes tv guides and all that different stuff so you just want to click it right click it or press enter or whatever you do just select it and once you do that it's going to take about five to ten minutes to install um at this point you could just take a break uh get something to drink or whatever have you but because it's doing its job for you uh so when you come back everything will just be in order so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to fast forward this this video uh, straight up to the completion and I'm going to show you what else to do and what it has inside of it. So thank you guys, continue to watch it. Okay guys, uh, you can see that it says complete. 
Uh, what I'm going to ask you to do is just press OK because it's telling you you have to forcefully close Cody. Uh, it's going to close Cody for you. So just press OK and then go to Yes, Close. And it's going to close Cody for you. At this point, what I want you to do is just open up Cody once more. And it's going to give you a little startup video. Uh, like that. That's, pre that's a pretty cool intro. So that's, that's a good tweak at first uh, from the spins. TV and tell me what you think about it it looks from to me it, it looks really sleek like it's it's really cool looking oh and if you look to the top of the screen you see where it says video nod or node uh, that's that's definitely a nice little tweak up there I like that you don't really have to go into the add-on itself it has all the like little descriptions and stuff up there that's pretty cool um, have little TV guides have all the little TV guys down here. That's pretty nice. I like that. I like that a lot. Got your live sports section. Got your regular add-on section, and you got your kids. Wow, that's pretty cool. You got your movies, television shows, and it has all the add-ons and stuff like that categorized. Entertainment, TV, music, uh, programs. Now, just like any other build, I don't consider any build to be good unless uh, you have the ability to still add add-ons and take away add-ons and be able to add sources. And this is definitely still there, so you still can do those things. Uh, you can still go into systems and all your settings and stuff like that and still change things. So definitely, I give this a thumbs up. Uh, check it out on Spins TV Wizard. So thank you guys for watching this video. Please like and share this video. Subscribe to my channel. Try out the build. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Um, just like any other build, I'll leave the developer's uh, contact inside the description if you have to contact him and if anything um, relating to how to do something, if something isn't working. I'm sure that you saw already that I, I left a little note on the video itself showing you how to fix it if uh, it didn't install properly. So thank you guys once more. Peace.